Hey class, welcome back. Hope you guys are doing well. This is week two of CIC 350, Intro to Data Communications. Hopefully last week, you guys kind of got a feel for how the class operates. The same structure is gonna pretty much uphold throughout the rest of the semester. Um, weeks two, three, four, five, you know, it's all gonna be relatively the same, right? We got some content we review. We also have a PowerPoint and then we, go into our quiz and then our discussion board. So our main, remember our main um, way we get points are through the quizzes in the discussion board. That's your real assignment, All right? We're just trying to keep it simple. It's a one unit course, nothing too extensive, right? All right, so if you guys go ahead and jump into Canvas under the module section. So we're pretty much done with module zero and one. If you want, you can review the syllabus, hopefully, you reviewed the syllabus last week. But going to module two, we're gonna go into the application layer, all right? So I'll upload this overview video um, in the module two overview page, all right? So as I mentioned, right, we review the content, we review the uh, PowerPoint for chapter two, take the module two quiz, and then do the module two discussion board, all right? Um, the quiz and discussion board each are gonna be worth five points and all assignments are gonna be due by June 19th, 11.59 p.m., all right? So the PowerPoint is put up, so go ahead and download it or review it, you know, whenever you get the chance. Um, and I actually recommend reviewing the PowerPoint well watching the module two video, which is going to be our content for this week, right? So here I talk about the application layer in this video and go ahead and review the PowerPoint as I go through it. Take notes if you need to. Some people don't need, you know, to write everything down, but um, are just better visual or audio um, learners. So. Do what works best for you, you know? But here's the content. Uh, don't, as I mentioned, you know, this is a one unit course. Don't worry too much about the nitty gritty, the details, just understand the comp, uh, overarching big topics, all right? <clears throat> right? Like last week we were talking about the OSI model. You know, that's the bigger picture thing. So this here, you know, we're gonna be talking about the client server, these different types of architectures, right? Um, what's client server, what's end tiered, and so on, all right? Um, we, I do go into, so for example, when I'm talking about the nitty gritty, you don't really have to worry about this HTTP request uh, message methods, right? These get, post, head, delete, that's out of scope for this class. But I just throw that in here just in case you guys want to, you know, get a little more information. All right. But I go into the application layer, right? Anyways. Then we have our quiz and then we have our assignment, our discussion board. All right. So um, this is going to be kind of like our first discussion board where it's not kind of like an icebreaker, right? This actual about the class itself. So a lot of the times I'm gonna be asking you to do some research, right? Research is the best way to actually learn because you're, um, because you're kind of like exploring, right? Curiosity is the best way to explore in security, networking, IT in general. Forget about IT, just any topic that you're trying to learn about in life, right? So I want you guys to research slash Google cloud architecture and services on the web, all right? I want you to tell me who are the main vendors out there and what additional services do they provide, okay? Right. By the way, some of these discussion boards, I try to apply them to real world situations because this is some of the stuff that you have to know once you go out there, right? Um, in the real world working. 
So do you see any of these future trends in relationship to cloud services? Do you see any short-term and or long-term side effects and challenges? Finally, name the different types of cloud architectures and what they are each used for. So there are several cloud architectures. Um, that's for you to find out and to uh, write me a little thing on. All right. And remember, leave two comments, uh, feedback to at least two other classmates who get full credit. Um, use proper grammar, capitalization, college level writing, right? Post by Sunday evening, 11.59 p.m. And you're good to go. All right. So that's about it really for this week. Pretty simple, nothing too crazy. Discussion board quiz and just watch, what is that, like a 40 minute video? Nothing too bad. All right. With that, let me know if you have any questions. I'm more than happy to help out. Um, and until then, I'll see you guys next week. All right. Bye.